mga kawawmat, in this video, we will determine the opposite of the given integer. We will also apply the rules in subtracting integers. So first, fill in the blank. So we need to recall the rules in adding integers kasi uh, kailangan natin to sa pag-subtract ng integers. So just fill in the blank. So same signs, what are you gonna do if you have the same signs? You will add and keep. Next, if you have different signs, you will subtract. And then you have to keep the sign of the bigger absolute value. Okay, so tatandaan natin ang rules ng adding integers. Okay, so what's the opposite? So we will give the opposite o yung tinatawag nating additive inverse. So iisa lang yun. So what is the opposite of negative 3? That is positive 3. Positive 10 is negative 10. Negative 14 is positive 14. Positive 9 is negative 9, and negative 7 is positive 7. Now, how do we subtract integers? Okay, so we are actually adding the opposites. Kaya nga sabi ko kanina, dapat ma-recall mo o alam mo kung ano ang rules natin sa pag add ng integers. Kasi this is actually what we need, okay? So, in subtracting integers, we are actually adding its opposite. Okay? You have to remember the keep, change, change pattern. Okay? So, we have two cases. Okay? So, halimbawa, ito yung given ninyo. So, if you have A minus B, where B is positive here, okay? This is positive because this is minus. Okay? And then, this is, your subtrahend here is negative. So, malalaman natin na negative yung subtrahend natin kapag naka-enclose sa parenthesis kasi hindi siya pwedeng itabi dun sa operation natin. So, again ha, this is positive, this is negative. So, I know, baka yung iba ma mag malito, akala nila this is negative B, okay? So, you just have to follow the pattern, keep, change, change. So, if you have A minus B, so we will keep A so, we will keep A and then change from minus, that is that will become addition, so change. And then this is also change. So, th since this is uh, positive, that will make it negative. Okay? And then, so, another. So, this is keep. This is change. And then, this is also change. So, since negative yan, magiging positive. Okay? So, ulitin ko, keep A, change the sign, and then change the subtrahend. Keep the minuend, change the sign, change the subtrahend. And then, pag nagawa na natin to, proceed to the addition rule. So, babalik tayo dun sa pag same sign, i-add natin, and then different signs is a subtract natin. Let's have an example. So, I have here 8 minus 11. So, 8 will be keep. And then, minus, magiging add. And then, this is positive 11. So, I'll sabi ko nga, malalaman yung negative siya pag naka-enclose siya sa parenthesis. So, this is positive, magiging negative. So, we will now have 8 plus negative 11. Go back to the rule of addition. So, we will have, this is different signs. So, subtract. So, 11 and 8, that is 3, and then keep the sign of the bigger absolute value. Since mas mataas si 11, kukopyahin natin yung sign ni 11, which makes it negative. Next, keep negative 12, change the sign, magiging plus, and then change from negative, magiging positive. So, we will have negative 12 plus 16, and then... These two integers have different signs. So, ano nga ulit kapag different signs? Subtract. So, 12 and 16, that is 4. And then, mas mataas ang absolute value nito. So, kopyahin natin yung sign ni 16 and that is positive. Next, keep si 10. Change. And then, from negative 6, magiging positive 6. So, we will have 10 plus 6. So, same sign, add. So, 10 and 6, that is 16. And then, keep the common sign. So, since pareho silang negative, so posi ay, pareho silang positive, positive ang sagot natin. Next, keep negative 14, change. 
and then change. Positive magiging negative. So, negative 14 plus negative 8. So, that is same sign sila. So, same sign add. So, 14 and 8, that is 22. And then, keep the sign or common sign. So, pareho silang negative. That's why your answer is negative. Let's have another. So, I have here 3 minus negative 5. So, keep si 3. Change. And then, negative, positive. So, same sign, add. Okay. Next, negative 7. Keep si negative 7. Change. Change. Positive magiging negative. Now, same sign ulit sila. So, same sign, add. Okay. So, 17 and then keep the common sign. So, negative 17. Next, negative 40, keep, change, and then positive 20, magiging negative 20. So, same sign ulit sila. So, we will have 40 and 20, 60, keep the common sign. Next, keep, change, change, positive, negative. So, magkaiba ng sign, you will subtract. Okay, so 15 and 9, that is 6. And then, copy the sign of the bigger absolute value since mataas, mas mataas ito. So, kopyahin natin yung sign niya and that is positive. Next, I have 10 minus 9 minus negative 4. So, keep. And then, minus, that will be change. And then, positive, negative, change again. And then, change again. So, magiging positive. So, let us combine similar signs or same signs. So, 10 and 4, that is 14. Plus, negative 9. So, different signs. So, 14 and 9, that is 5. Okay? And then, keep the sign of the bigger absolute value. So, mas mataas to. That's why this is positive. Okay. So, I have here what number must be subtracted from negative 15 to get 10. So, since we have here the word from, ibig sabihin, yan ang clue natin na you have to write negative 15 dun sa unahan. Siya ang inyong minuen. Okay? So, yan ang magiging minuen natin. So, negative 15 minus, ang sagot daw ay 10. So, ibig sabihin, ano daw ang isa subtract natin sa negative 15 para makuha natin si positive 10. So, paano ang gagawin? Ito ang hinahanap. So, we will uh, subtract 10 to a uh, from negative 15. So, we will have negative 15 minus your answer, which is 10. So, we will have keep change, change, keep negative 15, change, and then positive 10, negative 10. And then, do the addition rule. Same sign sila. So, you will add. And then, keep the common sign that is negative. So, we will have negative 25 okay next what must uh, what number must be subtracted from a to get negative 4 so again we have the word from so nasa unahan dapat si 8 siya ang inyong minuen so we will have 8 minus your answer negative 4 so ano daw ang isa subtract para makuha si negative 4 so we will have 8 minus negative 4 so, keep change, change, keep 8, change your sign, uh, your operation, so that is plus, and then negative 4, so positive 4. So, same sign sila, you will have 12, and then keep the common sign. Now, it's your turn to answer. You may pause the video so you can answer on your own without looking at the answer key on the next slide. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you learned something. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell para updated kayo for more video tutorials. This is your guide in learning your math lessons, your Walmart channel.